Stay focused and energized using G Fuel. You can use the discount code OGXRays to get 10% off your entire order. Yo, what's up, guys? It's Hexers. Welcome back to another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video. Now, whatever you guys, today is going to be talking about hashtag Black Market Blackout. And for you guys that don't know, most of you guys probably know about this, but basically, it is a movement going on. A bunch of YouTubers support it, other YouTubers are against it. Basically, the movement is don't buy any COD points from April 1st all the way to June 30th. So, don't buy anything until July 1st. Now, apart from that, another one of the stipulations was that you needed to not promote that content. Don't promote the new weapons, anything new in supply drops if you're a YouTube content creator. I also just saw a video recently of White Boy 7th Street just going in and uh, just making a whole bunch of claims about Prestigious Key. Now, I don't really know Prestigious Key personally, but I do know that he's a stand-up guy. I know that he tries to do the right thing all the time. And, you know, he did make a video about Black Market Blackout. He ended up kind of really thinking about it and thinking how at the end of the day, it was probably going to hurt more than it did help now here's my stance on the whole situation i would prefer not to buy any more cod points but i'm also not the kind of guy who wants to make call of duty and activision and treyarch fail just because something isn't going the way we want it to go i was one of the first people to make a video talking about supply drops and how crap they are the earn rate and it just fed up with that whole system but i also understand that activision is a business and they need to make money they're about the bottom line they're about the bank account and the money and you know it goes with the territory if i had a business i would want to make as much money as i could but i would also want to be reasonable and fair so i think that we should be giving them suggestions on what to do and there has been a ton of really awesome suggestions across the community of what they should be doing or what they could be doing so i know personally that activision is listening and trying to take in all of the criticism and all the ideas and they're trying to make something work and you know hopefully in the future we will have something like a way to just buy the weapon weapons or a supply drop that has the weapons or some sort of market where you can trade your weapon that you have for another weapon hopefully something like that happens but i think that this movement more than anything is causing harm because it's causing people to fight against each other for no reason i mean it's something in game it's not something physical if you want to spend the money spend the money i'm not here to tell you how to spend your money i know people who i could say hey they just wasted two thousand dollars on cod points but you know what at the end of the day that's their money and if they want to spend two thousand dollars on cod points or two thousand dollars on the most worthless piece of crap ever they can do it and there's nothing i can say and there's honestly nothing i should say against them because it's their money that they got by themselves and if they want to waste it they can waste it that doesn't mean that i support the idea of cod points and i support the system that they have out right now but you know if someone wants to spend cod points on it who am i to stop them i'm just some youtuber and am i gonna buy cod points in the future if they change the system around and it's more fair then maybe i will but as of right now i'm not buying any cod points if i upload content which i will be uploading content on the new weapons it's going to be people who let me use their gameplay or me using an account that has a gameplay or i'll make videos like i've done before where i show you guys how to use the weapons without having to pay cod points offline just for fun so i'll continue to do that but as far as buying cod points and promoting the idea of buying cod points i won't be doing that but again i'm not going to be here and say that someone's dumb or someone's stupid or that someone in the words of white boy 7th street loves the cod cock i'm not gonna say that because it's not really fair to anyone to say that when you have a difference in opinion like you shouldn't be calling someone out because they changed their mind or because they have a different opinion from you i mean it's causing a civil war and it really shouldn't do that we should be working as a community and respecting each other as a community and as gamers not trying to bash on others because they don't want to join a movement that quite frankly might do more harm than good so there we go that's my opinion on black market blackout i won't be buying cod points unless the system is a little bit more fair and i know that treyarch is doing the best they can to work around this and make this as fair as possible while still trying to make this something that activision would approve so we have to understand both sides of the story thank you guys so much for watching the video if you enjoyed it leave a like and a favorite it does get the content out there and it is very much appreciated and if you are new if you want to see more content like this in the future you already know i'm going to be posting a ton of call of duty black ops 3 zombies news multiplayer and cod 2016 so make sure to subscribe if you guys want to keep talking black market blackout or anything twitter is the best place to do so go ahead and follow me over there along with instagram and facebook and i'll see you guys next time i'm out peace